Hello everyone, this is DarkSonic1997 and tonight and tonight I'm playing the City of Opera Omnia. And right now um this is the second part of Let's Talk About Lafinia. Like we're gonna be going through the next four Lafinias that I went through. Or the next four Lafinias after um the Bahamut Lafinia and this is actually after I got this is being recorded after the Camel Knot summons just um yeah anyways um let's go ahead and go to Gal's uh, Gal's Lost Chapters Ga after the Bahamut Ultimate Trials, the next, the next one was Gal, and I get, to be honest, I forgot, like, I forgotten what team I used for Gal's Lost Chapters, and, um, and the team, like, the team I can think of right now would be this team for Gal's Lost Chap, for Gal's Lafinia. Um, Edward to, um, like, Gal, obviously Gal can counterattack, and he has earth damage, earth enchant, and earth imperil, so Gal definitely will, Gal will definitely take out the enemies, wait, I think it might have been Kurosami that I used. Yeah, I think it was Kurosami, not Kuda. I think I used Kurosami for this. I think. But yeah, Gal. Gal, um. is obviously. I'm sorry, guys. We used Gal for the earth damage to keep the Lufinia orb from counting down and of course the counter attack too and for Edward to put the enemies to sleep with his LD ability lullaby especially on the first wave because if I remember correctly after a certain amount of HP damage the boss will deal an HP attack that, if I remember correctly, will take out one of your allies or your entire part entire party. I could be wrong, but but yeah, Edward's lullaby, his LD, was it kept the first wave, the boss from the first wave um, from using that HP attack. And the rest of the wave, we, um, yeah, was, um, I'm sorry guys, the, the, the next two waves, we, um, just went for it with Gal, Curse on me, yeah, just, I'm sorry guys, but this is the team we used, or I used, I'm sorry, for the Lafinia fight. Gal only has that for the artifact passives. Um, this is Edward's artifact passives that I used. Matter of fact, Edward didn't have the. Um, I did it without it. I just realized that. Um, I just recently got Edward's character boards up. But I didn't really use them, so there was really no point to what I just did. But yeah, Kurosami is these three, these three passives, and yeah, I'm trying to do this before Gladio leaves. So yeah, because Gladio is leaving soon, and yeah. He would be leaving on 
Tuesday, I think. Yeah. For Gladio, we used Kurosami, Gladio, and Gal. Gal, for what I heard, Gladio and Gal makes make a perfect make a great team. Gal with the battery and counter and the earth earth in peril and enchant and gladio being able to um you know but the main thing is the counters like gal can once someone gets hit gal can battery gladio while doing his um ld or his first skill and then gladio can his first skill or his LD and then Gladio can counter with <laughs> dealing a lot dealing more damage than he does before and of course Karasame for the HP damage the increase HP damage so yeah this is the team I used for Gladio's Lufinia And after that would be lightnings or the raid event. For this one I used I'm trying to No, that's not that that's not it. That. Oh this one, right. I used Lightning, Ardine, and Gladio. Gladio obviously for the counters and the reduce brave and HP damage and all that. And um, Ardine, he, he's one. Of, he's a burst character. I mean, Ardine for not only his burst and but also the rebreak that he has. And um, and of course his LD ability, allowing them to survive any HP damage unless the unless it's unless it gets dispelled I'm sorry and of course lightning with her her ability with her thunder damage her thunder damage and her I'm sorry guys I'm a I'm, I'm yeah I'm sorry Lightning with her thunder damage and her ability to delay the opponent and of course her LD ability which gives her free free turns and I think it was Yeah Yeah free turns and does not consume a ability usage for the next two turns and um, for did I show I don't think I showed Gladio this is what Gladio has right now it just popped up in my head lightning yeah lightning she has 108 Flourish of Steel and two 330s and a defense and defense up. And for Ardine, he has these two attack 108, attack 65, and two 330s. And. And for the recent Lufinia that just came out, which that just came out, I actually completed Camel Knot's um, Lost Chapters before making the summon video. This is the team I ran on this Lufinia. And um, apparently, you the best way to I'm sorry guys, 
The one way you can, aside from evading the Lufinia Orb with Edge, um, you have to have characters that can do paralysis, paralyze the boss, or put them to sleep, which I, which is what I did with the, with the first attempt, which, which is what I did for this Lufinia. I brought Edward in and everything was good. Like, obviously you had to wait for the Lufinia orb to show up, but yeah, everything was all good. And Pinello for healing, of course. The, um, the call ability for Pinello, hang on, Pinello's call ability. For the regen waltz, because regen waltz, because we don't have a healer of any kind. We have battery, we have increased damage, HP damage, and we have thunder, thunder and pearl, thunder damage, delay, and all that. But we don't have a healer, and that's one of the downsides because. Because even though I have Edward's LD, it only has three uses, and and the um, I can only use it. Damn, I can only use the um, like you only get five turns of the sleep uh, the, on the enemies and. If you hit them or if they take a turn, it goes down. So pretty much it goes down fast. So especially when you're attacking them. So best way to do it is to um, the best way to go for this is to um, let the let the let them take a turn when lullaby the sleep debuff is on before attack before continuing attacking them or delaying them or yeah just don't delay them too much because that will make the lullaby go down fast or the debuff it'll, it'll have the sleep debuff go down fast and and the possible chance of overusing the lullaby just try try to do less de try to do less delays and more on letting them take their turns but yeah as long as as long as they take their turn and not <sighs> I'm sorry I'm I guess I'm a I'm thinking or I'm out I'm definitely not out of breath but I'm trying to think what to say sorry guys but yeah just um, make sure they take their turns while they're paralyzed or have their deep ups to keep the orb at to keep the orb from going down to zero so yeah Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. We already went through 14 minutes. Dang. Um, I'll have this video up tomorrow. Today is the 6th and tomorrow would be the 7th. So hopefully I'll have it up by the 7th. Hopefully I'll have it up tomorrow before Gladio comes out. But anyways, I hope... I hope you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe, and I hope, I also hope that um, this helps, this helps you guys, and yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time, on the next video, see ya, and stay safe out there guys, see ya.